Introduction to Workshop Practice After successfully completing this interaction, you will be able to answer these questions. What is a mechanical workshop? What are the types of different workshops? And is mechanical workshop only for mechanical technology? And what are the main support sections of a workshop department? The first thing to understand is what is workshop. So work is for the effort you put on, the time you spent and the energy you use to produce something. And shop is the place where you do that job or that work. So both makes you uh, makes a combination known as workshop. Practice is the training or the learning process, hands-on practical learning which you do on the workshop. So you need not confuse the technology with practice. The workshop technology is the applied laws and methods and principles and techniques developed for the workshop. And when you apply those techniques, when you use those techniques to develop something and train yourself, it is known as practice. So the next thing is that is a mechanical workshop re related to mechanical technology only. So that is not the case. If you see that mechanical word is attached with the workshop, it doesn't mean that it is only for the mechanical technology. You can have the mechanical workshop helping other technologies as well, like there are electrical or electronics departments or sections which also need mechanical workshop. Within the mechanical workshop, there is normally an electrical fabrication shop where do you do the electrical work. And similarly, uh, like metallurgy or casting or all these things also they need mechanical workshop. So sometimes foundry or smithy shop is also available as a part of mechanical workshop. So many other technologies they are dependent on mechanical workshop to develop their products. There are two types of workshop depending on how you are going to use their workshop. There can be the training workshop, which is used for, for practice or for learning. And if you are going to develop some products or you are doing some services to some client, you call it a production. So you produce something. Okay, you have a product there in the production workshop. So there are two types, the training workshop and the production workshop. So in the production workshop, you produce a large number of items or products, maybe sometimes small in number or depending on the type of production workshop. Uh, but in the training workshop, you only train the people. A typical mechanical workshop is not only workshop, it has many other support sections. So let's see how a typical mechanical workshop looks like. So the first of all, we have the workshop itself, which is composed of many machines doing different jobs. Then we have the inventory store, which involves the store of the material where raw material is present and you can use them for making different jobs. And then you have the tool store where you have the tool and different measuring instruments available for doing different operations. Then you have the draft or design office or section, which has the drawings or the samples which are used for making the new ones. Then you have the quality control or inspection section, which measures and checks if all the jobs are being done correctly and according to the drawings. And it also ensures that all the measuring instruments are calibrated and up to date. 
then the safety control section is always there it doesn't do any direct job of workshop but it ensures the safety of the equipment the workers and the environment then you have the maintenance section which makes sure that everything is in service and all the equipment equipment and machines are working fine throughout the production or training period so you have seen that in a mechanical workshop how many different support sections are there in addition to workshop also you have seen that what is the workshop practice and workshop training and how workshop practice is different from workshop technology you have also seen that workshop can be used not only for mechanical technology but for other different technologies and we see the different support departments at the end now if you have any workshop in your vicinity can you identify the various sections or departments of that workshop please do comment if you have any questions in the coming videos we will learn more about the workshop